Hey, what is up guys? In this video, we're gonna be talking about Pokemon scams that you need to be on the lookout for because I'm seeing them everywhere and people are still falling for these scams, guys. So in this video, we're gonna talk about what the scams are and everything you need to know to avoid them. Hey guys, just wanted to interrupt myself here real quick because we are doing a giveaway, our first giveaway on the channel just to uh, show my appreciation. So to enter this giveaway, all you gotta do is subscribe. Make sure you're subscribed because I'm only gonna be picking subscribers. Second, make sure to like this video and then comment down below what you thought about this video and what you think about these slimy scumballs that are uh, scamming people out of their money and getting away with it too and people are still falling for it. So comment down below, make sure that you're subscribed and like this video and you'll be entered to win. All right, let's flip this camera around and look at the computer. All right, so we're looking at a screenshot right now that I took because they took down the scam on eBay of this Pokemon Unlimited Edition base set booster box, okay? And it may look legit at first, but guys, this is a scam. So first off, a huge red flag is that this seller has no feedback. So I'm not saying you shouldn't buy from sellers that don't have any feedback or have a low amount of feedback, but I am suggesting that you wave caution, especially if you're putting in a bid like this, $8,600 right here, guys. And it was actually higher than that after I had taken this screenshot. I think it made it its way all the way up to $11,000. And you can see here, if we uh, go over the next slide, we can see here are the bidders. 28 bids, nine bidders. So people are still falling for these scams, guys. So what is the scam here? Well, it's for your money. And it's not gonna be through eBay that they get your money because you have the eBay money back guarantee where if you don't get sent anything, then eBay will take care of it and they'll give you your money back. Your money's gonna be tied up. So whoever this is that bid that $10,000, their money, they might not see it in their account for another month or two. But here's the scam guys, look at this. Experience the same product with better prices and personalized service on our website. They're trying to get you to go to their website and purchase this box off of there. They have this picture here of this LCS that is a real LCS, but it's not theirs. It's not their store. They just took a picture of it. And I've seen this exact picture for different posts from different no feedback sellers on eBay. And they've got you know the 2023 copyright TS collectibles, all rights reserved. And they even say, please note this auction will be ended at any time. And literally a day after I took the screenshot, the auction was taken off because it's a scam. It was taken down because somebody flagged it and eBay recognized that it was a scam. So they're trying to get you to go to their website. I'm not gonna go to the website here, but they're trying to get you to go to their website where you'll most likely never see your money again. So avoid these scams, guys. Another huge red flag with this if we take a look here at the 7% Black Friday discount on our website, and then the little blue emoji there, that blue circle is just trying to replicate the authenticity guarantee that eBay has for their verified products. And I'll put up a screenshot right now of some things that have the actual authenticity guarantee. And this is just a, a little blue emoji. It's a little blue circle that they are using to look like it's authentic when it's not at all. And then, you know, they're saying the 7% Black Friday discount on their website to try and encourage you to go over to their website. So do not fall for this. If they're trying to get you off of eBay onto their website, don't do it, guys. It's 100% a scam. All right, next up, we're going to be looking at AliExpress. Funny enough, guys, as you can tell here, we've got the DIY Pokemon Rare Van Gogh card. That's right, guys. This card is being sold to people for $170, $180, and it's fake. And you really cannot tell the difference between this and the real on a picture, okay? I've seen this card in other photos that were actually authentic. And there's no way to tell unless you get it in your hand and you know what a real Pokemon card feels like. So if this is really preying on those people that are not uh, very familiar with Pokemon cards, and it's also preying on people that are local, so really they're trying to prey on people that are buying in person as well, because if, if it's a cash deal, then they're not gonna get their money back. But if you buy this off of eBay and you realize immediately, oh, this is a fake card, this is obvious, and you return it, then usually eBay will help you out because you can contact their support team and they'll help you out with returns and you can just say that it wasn't real. And um, But guys, you need to watch out for this because I've seen this card all over the place. I mean, it, people are going crazy for it. And 
I mean, it's an awesome card, but here it is, $3, buy it off of AliExpress, and it's, it's a completely fa fake card, guys. All right, guys, so what are my key takeaways from this video? Number one is if the seller has low feedback, then make sure to be cautious, okay? Because I'm not saying you shouldn't buy anything from them because you know, we, I wanna support those low feedback sellers that are just starting out. But if it's a $10,000 or $15,000 sealed booster box, then it's probably a scam. And that leads us to our second key takeaway, which is if it sounds too good to be true, it probably is. And in this case, we saw that booster box, it was sitting at 7,000 and then 8,000 and then 8,600. Those boxes normally are going for 13 to 14,000. So it can be tempting as a buyer to say, oh, this is a really good deal, so I'm just gonna put in a low bid and see if I can get it. But you need to check the description beforehand. That's also another thing that you should be wary of and always check the description before putting in a low bid or any bid at all. Make sure to check the description. And if they're trying to take you off of eBay or take you to their website, it's definitely a scam. Do not leave eBay, do not go onto their website, and do not purchase anything because you're most likely never gonna see that money again. If there is a card that is selling for a low dollar price or a sealed box that's selling for a low dollar price, it's also probably a scam because I'm sure that what's gonna happen is you're gonna see some of these Pikachu gray felt hats around and in person and they're gonna be selling them for 30, 40, $50, because that's a huge markup off of this $3 price tag that they bought it for. And they're gonna sell it to you for super cheap. And you know, for the untrained eye, you might not know that it's, it's a fake card, which I do wanna cover that in a future video, what fake cards look like and what to look out for for fake packs as well, and also resealed packs. So look out for that future video. All right, guys, that's gonna wrap up this video. Don't forget to subscribe, like, and comment for a chance to win that Roaring Moon EX box. And also, go ahead and check out my Instagram page. Uh, I've got an Instagram that is growing and uh, I'm super excited to interact with the community. You guys have been showing a lot of support and I really appreciate that. Anyways, that's gonna wrap it up for me. Take care, guys. Much love. Peace.